What's going on guys? This is Puck Prophecies back at it again. Today we're gonna try to name all 31 NHL mascots. So let's get right in. Okay, so the first mascot we have here is from the Anaheim Ducks. Now this guy's looking uh he's looking pretty crazy. I I honestly I have no idea like he's probably named like Mighty Duck or something like that. I keep thinking like Darkwing Duck. I don't know why, but that's like, that's, uh, that's DuckTales, right? Like that's, <laughs> I think I'm going to go with, uh, with Mighty Duck on this one. Let's see. Okay, next up we have the mascot of the Arizona Coyotes. I mean, that's a, that sure is a coyote. Good job, Yotes. That was a, <laughs> that's a <laughs> man, that shit's booty's looking banging too. God damn. I, hmm, I think, you know, I'm going to go with Yo Yodi. Let's go with Yodi on that one. That seems pretty good, right? All right, next up, we got the Big Bad Bear from the Boston Bruins. You got to think his name's Bruin, right? Like, I don't, it's a bear. I'm, I'm going with Bruin. I'm going with Bruin on this one, 100%. Pretty confident, I think. What the hell is this thing? It's just, it's just another bear? <laughs> it's just another bear. He's got a helmet on. That's so stupid. Is this, his name's going to be Blue, isn't it? Blue the bear. I can already tell. Okay, this next mascot we got here is from the Buffalo Sabres. He's kind of looking like a cheap rip off of Tone of the Tiger here. Like a, th like a three-year-old drew him or something. He's got two... Just big dumb fangs sticking out. I I couldn't even begin to guess at this one. <laughs> I don't even know, man. Sabi, Sabi the saber tooth tiger. Let's do that. So this next one is the mascot for the Carolina Hurricanes. Honestly, just completely shocking. I I would have never guessed in a thousand years it would be like a pig. Or a cow? I don't, I don't know. Some kind of farm animal. Some kind of livestock. <laughs> There's probably some pun here that I'm missing, but I'm going to go with ham sandwich for this guy. I don't know, <laughs> man. That's a rough one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this Nets mascot uh, is for the Calgary Flames. <laughs> I don't even know what that is, man. <laughs> oh. Like, he looks like he just saw, like, he saw the Matthew Kachuk between the legs freaking goal. That, he's, he's shocked. Look at his face right now. And his eyebrows are drawn, all, like, on his eyeballs. Like, how does that happen? He looks like a squirrel or, like, a muskrat? Fla flamey? Flamey's, like, the most basic. Like, that's, that is just lazy on my part. But I don't know where else to go with this. Let's go with Flamey. <laughs> Okay, this next one we got here is for the Chicago Blackhawks. It, you think it's going to be that simple. It's going to be like some racist, like, Tomahawk or Chief Big Wig or I don't know. <coughs> He's got a freaking tambourine for some reason. I don't know why. Just banging on that tambourine. Yeah, I'm going to go with Tomahawk on this one. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling Tomahawk. Dude. All right, this next one here, mascot of the Colorado Avalanche. He looks like a Bernese Mountain Dog, which is sweet. That's a great dog. I, oh. I don't even, he, he just, he, that's a great mascot. I'm going to give an A plus to that, first of all. Boney? Is it something with mile high, possibly? I don't know, man. Let's go with Boney. That's so bad. Alright, next up, we have the mascot for the Columbus Blue Jackets. He looks like a bug. I really, I really thought he was going to be like a colonial soldier, because like the whole cannon thing. I don't know why it's a bug. Like, what is that thing? Just a big green bug with red eyes. That's it. Cannon bug? I don't know, man. <laughs> I'm an idiot. I have no idea. I'm going to go cannon bug. I'm doing it. All right, next up, we have the mascot for the Dallas Stars. He kind of 
just looks like a Muppet <laughs> a little bit. That's not great. This are the like what are those? He's got like two like hockey sticks on his head. Like what is even going on there, man? That's just bad. Like it's the Dallas Stars. Make him a star. <laughs> you could call him Starry. It's so easy. I I don't even know where to begin with that. I don't even know what he could be called. I <sighs> cowboy. I don't know. I'm I'm ashamed of myself on that one. <laughs> Next up. Can you guess? <laughs> it's the mascot for the New Jersey Devils. This is just smart. It's just smart. It's the devil. The team's name is the devil. The mascot's the devil. It just made sense. He's got a great goatee combo going on. Yellow tongue. Love it. I'm going to go with Satan. Would they name him Satan? It's a little risque, but I'm going to go with Satan on that one. Or Devin the Devil. That would also be good. Let's go with Satan, though. Again, here we go. Another just super easy mascot. You can tell for the mascot for the Florida Panthers. It's it's the dude on the jersey. Like, that's... How easy is that? That's all you gotta do. Like, the intern is coming up with the mascot. Just be like, yo, dude, copy the jersey. It's genius. Instead, you got Columbus freaking having a bug for their, for their mascot. It's insane. That's just... That's a great mascot. He's got great paws. He's just happy to be there. He kind of looks like Tony the Tiger is like creepy uncle, but that's okay. I'm going to go with, uh, hmm, Patty the Panther. Yeah. Okay. So we got the mascot for the LA Kings right here. And you might say, why the hell is it a lion? Simple, simple fact here. Lion is the king of the jungle. LA Kings are the kings of the NHL. It just makes sense. It's genius. It really is genius. Now, I remember playing as this guy in NHL 19. You can play him on the three-on-three -three game mode. That special game mode. I, I, oh, I score goals with this guy. I cannot remember his name. Lionel. Let's go with Lionel the Lion. Okay. Next stop, we got the best mascot in the league, repping my boys, Carlton the Bear. Me and Carlton go way back. Just have a personal relationship. Love this guy. He's just he's just a happy bear. Just a sweet polar bear. Best bear mascot in the league. Carlton, my boy. Love it. 10 out of 10 mascot right there, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. All right, this next one. Uh, the mascot for the uh, Montreal Canadiens kind of just looks like a homeless guy who hasn't shaved in like 20 years. Is that what a happy taunt is? Is that like this crazy fairy tale creature that comes out of the forest and steals your children? <laughs> oh man, I'm gonna go with Harry. Harry the happy taunt. <laughs> All right, next up, we got the Nashville Predators mascot. Just freaking, he looks sweet, man. He looks like he's ready for business. This guy's like the villain in like a crash game or like a spiral game. You know, I could totally see it. He looks freaking sweet, dude. I like Good job, Predators. Now for the name, <laughs> fucking beats me. Um, hmm. What is something that Nashville is known for? The country... Country music. Who's a country star that he could be named after? Johnny Cash. All right, let's. Let, maybe his name's Cash. Let's. Let's just go for it. Draw a blank on that one. That's rough. So I'm not gonna lie. I had no idea that the New York Islanders mascot was a freaking dragon, man. Oh baby, that is sweet. Like that is that thing is awesome. I was talking about Spyro earlier. This guy's the main character in Spyro. He ain't the villain. This guy's the main... He's, you're playing as this guy. 10 out of 10, baby. I... Wow. The Islanders fans, they do not... They do not deserve that mascot. And they don't deserve... This player right here, either. Shots fired, I know. You think they can name him Spyro? Or is that like... That's gotta be trademarked, right? That's gotta be trademarked. I'm gonna go with Spyro though. Let's let's go with Spyro. 
Okay, first of all, this guy creeps me out. Mascot for the Pittsburgh Penguins. It looks like a penguin, but he's re like he's too skinny to be a penguin. He's real skinny. And he looks like that one Muppet. I don't know what is I don't know the Muppets' names. Who knows the Muppets' names? You know Kermit the Frog, you got the pig. I don't know. I don't know the other ones. He, that's a skinny penguin, man. And like his his beak is like his whole face. And he's like staring down that Philly fan, like, I'm gonna kill you. Like, holy dude. <laughs> that's too much. I'm thinking Perry. Perry the penguin? I'm probably like zero for twenty at this point. Maybe I got like one right. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go with Perry. Okay, so we got the Ottawa Senators mascot here, and honestly, he's just kind of a worse-looking lion than the LA Kings one. He's just like a. He's a ginger lion, and he looks dumb. Like his face looks stupid. I'm not intimidated by that lion. That's not. A, that's not a king of the jungle lion. And like you, you. I don't know, like, you're missing the opportunity to have the sweet, like, Spartan soldier as your mascot? I don't know why you would never do that. You think his name's, like, Sparta? Leonidas? Let's go with Leonidas. <laughs> so, we got the mascot for the San Jose Sharks. I know, crazy. This is just, again, it's just smart. That's just smart marketing. Whoever made this is a genius. Just keeping it simple, stupid. Make it a shark. Your team name is the Sharts. His name's probably Sharky. I'm gonna go with Sharky. Yeah, Sharky. Okay, we got the mascot for the Tampa Bay Lightning here. I actually do know his name. One of the only ones I know. I know. Thunderbug. This little guy. I don't know why it's Thunderbug. It's kind of frustrating. I feel like it should be Lightning Bug. Because, like... Thunder is the sound, and lightning is like, you know, what a lightning bud does. Like, it lights up. It doesn't make loud noises. <laughs> uh, whatever, man. I know his name. Accounts. Ring it up, baby. All right. Next up, we got the mascot for Van City. Just sweet killer whale. Once again, you're just going with the jersey, going with the, what the team is about. Just a sweet killer whale. He's got some slick boots on. I guess you don't really know what to do with the feet because he like you know orcas don't have is orca and a killer whale the same thing either way they both don't have feet he looks like he's having a hell of a time i'm gonna call him orky orky the orca orky the killer whale let's go with that <laughs> all right next up we have the mascot for the washington capitals bald eagle the bald eagle and it made sense that's the capital of the United States of America, Bald Eagle, stands for freedom, all those things. It just, it's a great mascot. He looks sweet. He looks like he can bite your head off. He's got a 10-foot wingspan. Look at that. He's ready to take off right now. I'm going to go, uh, Baldy? I know that's what they call me sometimes, but... Uh, let's go with Baldy. Let's go with Baldy. Excuse me? All right. Uh, the mascot for the Minnesota Wild... I don't even know what's going on here, man. He's got like face tats like Mike Tyson. I don't know if those are trees or he's got like a he's got like a down arrow on his forehead. <laughs> like, uh that's horrible. I don't know if that's a bear or a tiger. Like that is just trash. Minnesota Wild. Step it up, man. His name's probably Minnie. Like Minnie Mouse, but without the mouse part. I'm yeah, I'm gonna go with Minnie. That is just a trash tier mascot. Hate it. Hate it. All right. I love this guy. This is sweet. We got a moose here. Mascot for the freaking Winnipeg Jets, baby. Just a good old Canadian moose. Now, I've been harping on teams for not going with what's on the jersey as their mascot. This is one of the exceptions. You can't just make a jet. That would be insanity. Just have this, like, anthropomorphic jet, like, <laughs> walking down the aisle, can't even freaking move. That would be awful. I understand why they went with the moose here. Just a classic Canadian symbol. Love it. He's got, like, sweet, like, eyebrow bones, too. Like a dinosaur, almost. Great set of teeth. Let's go with moose tracks. Let's go with that. 
That seems about right. <laughs> All right, so next up, we have the mascot for the Detroit Red Wings. It's an octopus for obvious reasons. They freaking throw octopi on the ice for whatever reason. I don't know, it's like a playoff tradition or some shit. Obviously, there's not a person in there. It would take like 20 people to man that thing. Like 20 children, 20 orphans would have to be <laughs> manning the, the legs and the arms of that freaking beast. Uh, let's go with Wiggly. Let's go with Wiggly on that one. <laughs> All right. Next up, we have the mascot for the Edmonton Oilers. Now, I'm a scumbag and accidentally saw his name when I was looking him up. His name's Hunter. I don't, like, why? Why is it another cat mascot thing? <laughs> it's the Edmonton Oilers. What do you have to do with, why, are you, why is your name Hunter? What are you doing? Who the, f make him an oil rig. That would be sweet. Hunter's so lame, man. Zero to ten. I'm not even rating these guys, but zero to ten. Get out of here. All right. Next up, we have the infamous mascot for the Philadelphia Flyers. Gritty. Gritty himself. How could I not know? This guy is a meme lord. He's all over Twitter. He's just a freaking animal, man. I mean, Gritty's sweet. I'll be honest. Great mascot. He, I don't know what he's supposed to be. He scares me. I see those eyeballs in my dreams, those in my nightmares. Oh man, yeah. Great mascot though, Gritty. Alright, we have the mascot for the Vegas Golden Knights here. And I do know his name! I know it, his name's Chance. It's a great name. Tied it into the casino strip gambling life of Vegas. It's beautiful. Now, I don't know if you guys watch Spittin' Chicklets. But Rear Admiral, the host, has said that he has had a part in picking this this creature, this lizard, whatever this thing's supposed to be. I call it bullshit. He said he was tweeting at the Vegas, whatever, the like Vegas guys all the time saying, pick this lizard, pick this lizard. He thinks he has a part in naming it. I call it bullshit. He thinks, I don't know. I just call it bullshit, man. All right, guys, so I counted up the results. It looks like I got six out of 31, or six out of 30, because the New York Rangers are the mascot for some reason. Either way, that was pretty rough. Uh, I'm kind of ashamed of myself. As a lifelong hockey fan, I don't know any mascots, apparently. Uh, hopefully, you guys did better. Um, as for right now, though, I'm going to walk away with my tail between my legs on this one and call it a day. All right, guys, I'm, I'm signing out. Have a great day. See ya.